Like that I was talking about. I made it for you. It's not a race. <laughs> ben just made me a delicious beverage. Well, uh... <clears throat> it was a nice... I didn't know a that glass there was of bugs plain, in it. Glass plain wa a glass of plain water and Ben fed me a bug. I didn't know it was poop. <laughs> it was like an earwig inside of the straw in my cup of water. It's called an earwig instead of an earwig. And by the way, you don't have to reload at all if you have an AK-47 in this uh, game. But it's the Matrix Reloaded. But you don't have to reload. What if you have a nose like that? <clears throat> you don't have to reload boogers. I'm sniffing. I spell it out. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I was I was wondering like why the hell I said that in the commentary. Because I think you were just looking for it to fill dead space when we just started. I just it. It yeah. And you were like, I that's a that's a thing I have a real problem with is uh, even when I'm having a conversation in real life, like I just cannot allow like dead air. I think that's a good thing actually. That's not a problem. What is, uh, how's that a problem? It's a problem sometimes if you're in a regular you conversation, you can things. let dead space happen. That's fine, you know. But like when you're recording something. Like we were doing, mm -hmm. that is not a problem. You are supposed to fill it. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? Like that's the good thing. And guess what? We admit that we that was perfection. That that whole recording was perfection. <laughs> yeah. The Buttergriff gang was perfection. That was just so. about as. Uh, yeah. That was we peaked early. <laughs> what? It's all downhill from here. What? what? No. No. <laughs> no. You were. You were. Oh man. You you give up early. Look. Look, man. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm not trying to do that, alright? I know I did that way too much earlier. What? Look, come on. Look, fat. Come on. Hey, dude, did you hear about this, like, really cool meme it's about this guy named Joe Biden? He says, <laughs> look, fat. No, no you hear about this guy named Bennett White? He kept on saying, you're fat. He <laughs> does this. Ninja Biden. Ninja Biden. <laughs> Ninja Biden. Oh, yeah, by the way, I haven't gotten hit yet. At least that I know of. I just been holding the button you're not looking behind you. Oh, I've been killing, I've been killing civilians too. <laughs> Look at but. that beautiful cityscape. Look something, at the civilians. Not, something uncanny about it. It's not really moving. And the civilians too. I've been killing them. <laughs> you kill indiscriminately. Bye, civilian. There's a lot of really weird, like, sound effect errors in this game. What do you mean? Like right now, like I hear you blowing up cars, but then I hear the car like explode like five times. I'm getting hit by something, but I'm not looking behind me, so I have no idea what it is. Uh, you're not really getting shot, though. There's something oh. hitting me from behind, but I'm not looking, so I have no idea what it is. No, you're not getting... Oh, I'm it, getting it hit by something from behind, but I'm not looking behind me. I see what you're saying, and I, yeah, that's what's going on. Yeah, you really don't have to reload at all. I guess that's... <laughs> yeah, that's, uh... Bullets. If, lots like, of them. If they can bend... Matrix rules, can they like make guns with infinite ammo? Why do the rules <coughs> only apply to the people in there? And, and on top of it, why did Mouse have to use the huge guns and still die anyway? Look, it's Morpheus up there. You see him? Oh, is that him? It's Morpheus fighting uh, one of the agents. I'm not Cowboy Colin! I don't want to rewatch Reloaded. Reloaded is a good This is when I wanted to watch this, like, while I was playing this game. I wanted to, like, you yeah. know, catch up to, like, what was going on in this. Jeez. Yeah, what. The stuff that happens in this game like coincides evenly with what happens in uh, Reloaded. Yeah, it's like you see un it's like a side known story. footage. Oh god! Oh, just... that's not good. Oh come on! Come on! Come on, come on civilian! I gotta catch up to, to Morpheus. Okay, don't kill civilians. They're just gonna slow me down. All right, look, fat. All right, I gotta find the fat bullet. Oh shit! All right, I got it. No one. Oh shit! I almost. It's, it's, you know, it takes like three shots to kill any car in this, this guy. Way. This guy Morpheus, he's a real loser. He's fighting with Agent Smith. The agent's just doing his job. He's just doing his job. All right. He puts him um, down like that. He's filling the world full of false hope and fake narratives. Oh! Oh! You pooped under your in the hood of your car. Dang, people in the hood always Let's slamming watch this, on my hood. This part's badass. Let's it watch is this. actually. This is actually one of the best scenes. Cowboy Corbus, he has lightning in his pants. <gasps> this is where he fights with a sword. I thought that was just so cool. I really wish they did this more often, too. He had McDonald's I feel bad for, in his car. I feel bad for all the people in that. Uh, I feel bad for all the people in these like cars that are just kind of caught in all the commotion. <laughs> A lot of people got killed on this freeway during this <coughs> scene in the movie. You mean those people in the Matrix? This part was sweet, the movie. Yeah, it was. Who's gonna save them? 
playing it. Like, oh wait, doesn't Neo come out of nowhere? Just yeah. <laughs> I'll yep. take that. <laughs> you died. <laughs> what? You can't say that. You did, why did you say that? He sir, didn't die. Why did you say that? Sir, did you order McDonald's? No, sir, I didn't. Why did you say that? He didn't die. Why did you say that? Because I'm making up my own narrative. <laughs> you are fake news. That's like after, um, after okay. Michael Jackson died... Like, there's a comedian, he was like a guitarist comedian, he's just like, he has a guitar on stage, and he's like, you're dead. <laughs> like, right after he died, he had no, he gave no fucks. Well, everyone thought he was a pedophile, and then they all kind of, like, forgot about that when he died, and then people were like, no, it's yes, I'm sorry, she touched a few children, but this he was back in Jackson. Fuck. Huh? Like, this guy didn't give a fuck. Nothing! Save complete. Did you save it? Is your name Peter? Peter? Is your name Peter? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Peter? Is your name Peter? <laughs> Starts with a P. Is it a P? Peter. Peter. My name's Peter. Is your name Peter? Oh my God! You are some sort of psychic. <laughs> I thought you were doing the part where he's like, it's a jackal. Jackal. It's a jackal. Sort of. Is it a jackal? It's exactly, it's a jackal. It's a jackal. almost exactly. It's almost exactly like that though. Wasn't right the first time you said it? Why the hell would it be right the second time? <laughs> That's actually one Go! of the funniest lines ever. Because it was from the first couple seasons. Yeah. I'm gonna run back here. Some was that joke I just said. Like, he was at a psych... He's like, that's about at the time I went to that psychic, you know, like, psychic symposium. <laughs> like, I was like, you know, I'm thinking of someone's name. Oh, I have a name! I have a name! And he's like, uh, it starts with a P. I have a P! My P starts with my... I think so. It sounds like Peter. Peter. My name's Peter! Is your name Peter? Hey, oh my god, god, you are a psychic. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Give me your guns, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You shot him. You shot him right in the arm. Why did you do that? Why did you... <laughs> Why did you stand on the desk? Because I thought that was a weapon. Don't do it. Ever again. Hello? <laughs> I am ghost! Boink! Watch me. Watch me. <laughs> Sorry, I was trying to do a cool run-off-the-wall thingy. You failed, <laughs> I straightened his tie and it killed him. <laughs> Did you see that? What is it with you and failing, Seymour? <laughs> Seymour, what is it with you and fail? Yeah, what are you doing, Spider-Man? <laughs> you failed at that too as well. You have to fight a uh, agent again? Uh, I think you do, actually. And I think you actually have to beat him by hand in this mission, if I, don't, if I remember correctly. I shove you. Hello, I'm the nostalgic matrix, and I have to go back in time so you don't have to. Niobe is taking snipey fight. Take Where out the generator. Where's the man? Take them all out. Get a burn our man. <laughs> oh man, I miss burning our man in that game. It's really <laughs> fun. Gonna burn our man. Give me that shotty, mister. I want the shot gun. I wanna play quite a bit. Oh, no, I want it. Give me it. Give me that. No. Give me that. Hey. Give me that butt. Man down! <laughs> me! It's me! I'm down! Ah! These guys are way too serious about the job. I'm sorry, but most security guards oh. are like... Most security guards are like Stingray. They, they were not going to risk their life for their job. They're just going to beat the shit out of people until they get like, Oh, I'm out! Give me that stupid! Name Stingray. <laughs> you can call me Stingray. Okay, whatever, Chubbs. You got this. You have to take out the green generator. It is... Okay, climb, you fuck. I'm fat. You are on the hard oh. way case and for everyone. I turned off the light and I saved the Niobes. <laughs> <laughs> Niobes, it's, it's, Niobe is a really nice, wholesome Matrix girl. And I'm gonna see her boobs. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Oh, that wasn't... Oh, man, I thought I was being slick. I had speedrun tactics going there. Now Why don't you go back into the place where you're supposed to go in the beginning? Why don't you eat another <laughs> earwig, would you? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you feed me another earwig? Why don't you? I feel terrible about that, man. I seriously do. Yeah, it was tasty. Can I just, like, you know, <laughs> feed you another one? So No, no, I'm just kidding. No, I think Damn. what's fair is that you need to eat one now. Hello! Damn. I don't want to do that. What do I have to do to not do that? Uh, look. Here's the deal. On, uh, on uh, November 5th, I need you to vote for <laughs> Joe Biden. <laughs> That's about as equivalent as eating a, a near win. What would that, what would you, would you do that for someone if they asked you, if you owed them something? If you owed them something, would you, uh, 
vote for Joe Biden. Would you like, like, look fat? You need to go, Joe. Like, you make it sound Joe. like an extreme Republican. I mean, honestly, if no. I, I just mean, tomorrow, like, would you sacrifice your vote? Like, the whole thing about voting is you get your own say in who you vote for. But right? like, would you give that up if someone, if you were, someone was mad at you? What would it take for me to give up my vote for someone else? Exactly. Okay. Uh, what would you do to give up your vote? I'd do anything to protect my family. <laughs> if anyone fuck with my family. family. Nah, if someone, I mean, if someone held a gun, if someone held a gun to, to me or anyone in my family, yes. Okay, I'd vote for anyone. Uh, on a less serious note, if anyone put a bottle of honey above me the fuck? and said that I would be covered in honey, if I didn't vote for whoever I didn't want, I would vote whoever they wanted. You don't like honey? I don't like being sticky. I, I hate oh, being sticky. Oh, I've got a thing about that, too. I fucking can't stand I, lo- I actually love, like, the taste of honey. I me make, too. like, peanut butter and honey But I won't get it choking because... on my hands. Don't pour it on my hands. Yeah. Don't touch me. Don't, don't pour touch it on my me hands. with those sticky fingers. Oh, I my mean, God. I'm all the way back sniffing here. stuff. I don't... I don't... Mother father. Mother father. Watch your mother father mouth. It's 60, 60 meters. Keep going. We are running like robots. We are robots that are running. You know, actually, I think this is where I got this from. I run like him. I just <laughs> realized that I do that to be funny. I like flap my hands like like that. And I just realized it's from this game. Okay, I'm not fighting you. Fuck you. Fighting you, fuck. You get to be fought, but fuck the rest. You of tapped you. him on the chest and he fell asleep. <laughs> I know. What if you could do the five point exploding palm? technique from uh, Kill Bill. Where you, you ever, die like a day later? Where you take five steps and you die after your fifth step. That doesn't happen. It would be a lot cooler if it did though, wouldn't it? Yeah. It would be cool if you could do that in this game. That's like Fifth of the, fifth of the North Star like shit. I'm just taking everyone's weapons and running away so I don't care. Niobe is taking sniper fight. Wait, didn't you just do this? I died and it sent me all the way back because that's what this game Why does. did you do that? Because it's stupid! Why did you do that? Get out of my way, fuck! You got him. Uh, give me that. Friends for eternity, loyalty, honesty, we'll stick together through thick or thin. Watch out, he's climbing away. <laughs> Stop him. Find that child. Stop <laughs> that child. Your, your health goes up when you hit the green button. What the hell? I'm hitting the button. You hit, hit the, the button, button and your health ah! went, You won. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what just. What the fuck just. What the fuck? What the fuck just happened? <laughs> I'm I'm confused. Confused. It's a cutscene. Yeah, but you skipped through it so fast it looked like it was part of the game and it was really confusing. I was like, wait, what just happened? Come on, man. Come on, fat. <laughs> Come on. Why is that so stupid and funny? I don't know. Hello! You, you want to try to fit in those leather chaps. You, know, you, you look fat. You can't You can't do a push-up. I, I forgot you could do this. If you go into first person, it like automatically will like zoom in on the enemy, sort of. Oh. Okay, trick. There you go. Keep going, fat. Come on, man. I got a belly full of meat, man. Come on, man. I'm at the Renaissance Festival. I got no friends left. Have you got the system down now, too? It takes like a second for the the first person to show up, right? There you go. Did I get him? I think you did. Not yet, sir. (laughs) They're on! Damn! No! No! Why is it going down? What the fuck? What just happened? She just, like, got, like, killed immediately. I don't think I killed them all. Yeah, there was a guy behind you. You should probably take him or something. Yeah, get rid of the ship. (laughs) We can, uh, we can cut it back in when the guy's falling. Remember this was, like, a calculator screensaver? Yeah. I do remember that vaguely. This was, like, a real screensaver, too. Yeah, I remember, like, on your TI-83s, though, like, if you hit one and zero over and over again, like, you could fill up the entire screen and then you hit the clear button, it would do that. It would make that, like, trickle-down effect. Make your rounds and meet back here. Yeah. Why don't you just take... Yeah, my way. Oh, Hello. you are not even stealthy. Goodbye. Hello. Goodbye. Goodbye. What was that thing in, that we kept talking about for a long time when we watched, uh, uh... Fuck, uh, Father of the Bride 2. What was the name of that drug that, like, he kept on trying? Oh, <laughs> the Let's feed them, feed them some Bostick and make them fall asleep. 
was, what was the joke we were trying to make? Like, he just kept on trying to get like, Bosnick. He, he just, like, kept feeding George Banks Bosnick, Bosnick over and over. <laughs> and for everything, you just like, sign this bill for the new wing on your baby, baby land. Okay, now take two Vosnik. Yeah, it was just, just like, he was constantly, yeah, like, You ordered a him. double cheeseburger at McDonald's, take two Vosnik. Oh, yes. Oh, your daughter's getting mad today. Make sure you take a couple of Vosnik in the morning so you don't sleep. He's like Dr. Kevorkian for sleeping. <laughs> he's like, he's like, take two Fosnick for anything. Oh my god. I, I, I love that. 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 That was so funny. And I, when like, did we oh, start that? Where did we start that? Because that was oh, one of the funniest like co-ops we ever did. It was just like, yeah. take two Fosnick. Because <laughs> <laughs> you cut it before that, and I was like, what the hell just happened? Some cutscenes are really funny when you just cut them off early. Just take two Fosnick and you fall. Take two Fosnick and then fall to your death. Just take two Fosnick. Take two Fosnick when you're on sniper rifle right duty. Take two Fosnick and wear some later, okay? <laughs> oh man. Okay, take him down. Do I'm, okay. I'm having a better time already with the commentary. <laughs> <laughs> take two Fosnick. There you go. Okay, I'm just. I'm, I'm no scoping. No scoping, bitch. No scope, bitch. Street rules, bitch. Where are you, you? I was oh, right I there. See you. Uh, uh, I see you. I gotta one remember step. how to zoom in. Uh, crack shot! <laughs> what are you Not talking about? That cover was, fire. I thought that was the last one. Friends for eternity, loyalty, honesty. Stick together through thick, whore, thin. Kick him. Kick him in the ass. Kick his ass, Zebras. What the hell? That just went right through his leg. You got him. He's got hairy legs. <laughs> hairy legs. I'm sorry, I'm not trying to be political. It is a catchy song, though. It Regardless is really, that's generally affiliation. what it is. It's I mean, I would, I laugh the same thing if they did the same thing about Trump. I don't care. Like, yeah. Trump's got plenty of material there. I like the, the Chatelet song for Trump, actually. Well, that's not really, like, the same. But I'm sure no, they do no. have something like that for Trump. Get that chunky. You chunky monkey. I gotta learn Ooh. this stuff. Get him, get him. Hey, did, I, kill him. did I join? Oh, God. This is the guy that... Oh, God. Oh god! Oh, there she is. That, is. that one guy is, like, he's not attacking me whatsoever. Wait, you just leaving him? Oh, like, he's not bothering me. You called me one! <laughs> Get out of here. So what did you think about Sandra Bullock's new movie? I think she's a little saint. Eee! 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 Oh, did it work? It worked! I got him. Mm, I, you know another thing I miss that old games kind of used to have but they don't really anymore? Is uh, like the death animations when you kill someone. The ragdoll effects? No, like when you shoot someone. That's just it. Like nowadays it's all ragdoll. But I kind of miss like the the golden eye style animations when Why you shoot someone. Me? Yeah, you shoot them and then they like do this over dramatic death move. What the? Wait, befriend him. What? What is with this guy? Who is he? No, seriously, I want to know. His shadow didn't show up till now. Friend or foe? What is your story, mate? The story is... <laughs> oh, and that, that was, was the last all I was I... needed. That was why we weren't, like, going Proceeding? Past. Thank God. Come on, fat. Come you on, fat. Through. I entered the Matrix, fat. Come on, don't snap my neck. Oh. <laughs> I remember watching Clear and Present Danger when your sister was like, I'll warn you guys when Harrison Ford snaps her neck. And you're like, we need to get rid of her spine. <laughs> I like that movie. That's like the really funny, that like, was cl cl dig. Clear and Present Danger? I don't even remember that. I never saw the movie myself yet, but I remember we started to watch it and we got so ADD we just left and went swimming. Oh, you yeah. know? That's kind of how a lot of movies begin. I know. Like, that's what happened earlier when we were watching Ocean's 8. I remember your sister was holding the VHS tape in her hand and she was like tapping and she goes, I'll warn you guys when he snaps her neck and you're like, or when he, when he breaks you, her my neck. Good man. And we're like, okay, that's like the most violent thing we've ever seen. And then you switch to, when's he going to snap? When's he going to rip out her spot? I just wanted to know. I don't think I had seen anything like that yet. And like, that, where'd you that get kind that though? That's pretty violent to say, rip out their spine. It was probably, I probably got it from Mortal Kombat. I was gonna say, that's actually that like that quite a Mortal Kombat thing to say. Mortal Kombat! That was one shot. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I've gotten in the habit of just like tapping the fire button because a lot of times that's all you need to kill these enemies. Especially humans. Quick, quick little tapper. They stink, and I don't yes. want to hear. 
Okay, I was gonna say, did you save? Because I didn't save and I was scared. Did the cat go? What is this? Oh no! What is Come on, this? man! Come on, man! You don't need to open fire on me! Come on, man! What the hell is this? It's just a bunch of mans. Mans? They're all standing there in a, in a firing line ready to die for like the Like the redcoats, they're coming for you. I know what they're doing. They're here to blow up this place, aren't they? The mans. <laughs> Get the man. <laughs> I don't care about them. Get back the man, I'm we're not gonna, gonna burn that man. I'm not gonna let them ruin my good time running around. You know, I do think that it's kind of interesting that, like, all the characters in the Matrix just, like, kill all these, like, humans that are just plugged in in the Matrix. And, like, they, they don't even really make an attempt to not kill them half the time. They just, like, open fire. Like, you could disarm them and knock them out, right? But they never do that. No. They always, they always just, like, fire on them and kill them. Because life is they're useless. like, this is what we need to do. Because they're NPCs in real life, Nick. Yes. But, you know, NPC lives matter. They're NPC people of oh color. God. I can see that happening. I like that one right there. Why are all NPCs all men? <laughs> I was talking earlier about how all NPCs seem to always have like nice heads of hair. All right, come on. You want to fight me? You want to rumble? How come you can't argue with anyone in Oblivion that has like no lizard skin? Did that guy just fall? All right, come on, come on, man. Patience, come on, man. There come we on, go. Man. Got him. That was a perfect kick. I love doing that. Movie I know. Right I'm there. gonna try to zoom in on that if I can remember it. Is that a health pack? Oh, you're not dead, man. Come yeah, on, man. Bye, bye. Go down now. You fall down. Go boom. Stupid bug. You go squish now. Earlier, when I was drinking a bug that Ben gave me, you squished it I almost, throat. I almost went. You go squish now and crunched my teeth. What if you uh, yeah, bit down on a bug and then it was like going in between your yellow teeth and then... It happened to my brother, he was eating... Oh! oh god! He was eating syrup from waffles. Syrup? And there was a bunch of ants in it and my grandma said, Ew. there's not enough ants in there, there's not enough protein. Ew! That's gross. It was in Florida, I mean like, she didn't know. Oh like, man, oh I, I never told you this. Get in there, yeah. You wanna know what happened to me when I was in Florida? Huh. Um, so I had a bag of like... I had a bag of uh, chips or something, and I opened it, and then I didn't finish it right away, but I came back to it like maybe a week later, oh, and I geez. poured the chips into a little bowl to like eat out of, and there was just ants all over them, and they yep. poured out of the bag, yep. and I I didn't realize until that day, like, you need to like seal bags shut in Florida, otherwise yep. bugs just get everywhere, and this was right when we got the house down there, so... Yep. Don't do that. What are you doing? I'm trying to climb up this stupid little Clear ledge. Clear the platform. Put, put your, your gun away. Put your gun away, you stupid. Um, anyway, so I like, that was before we got our house treated for bugs. So oh like god, yeah, you had bugs galore, I'm sure, yeah. Ugh, it was nasty. Yeah, well, so you're used to I eating turn bugs. On I don't feel bad at all. You're used to it. I would, I would turn on the air conditioning. I didn't eat them. You ate them. So I would turn on the air <laughs> conditioning, and then bugs would, like, fall out of the air vents into my bowl oh, of Cheerios. God. Oh god, into your Cheerios? It's my Cheerios! Ew, what the fuck? Why would you let them in there? Because, Ben, this is you right here. I seem to be doing pretty good. <laughs> no, you died, see? <laughs> it took you way longer for someone <laughs> who has superhuman strength and speed. Shut up! <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> you know, for being Ant-Man, you're not doing so good. Oh, I wish I was Ant-Man. He gets real small. <laughs> yeah, but you can't get that small when you eat your own kind. <laughs> <sighs> Just keep feeding me bugs and see what happens. Try to own me again, kid. See what happens. <laughs> That's why you just got dropped. UPS truck. Oh, oh! Hey! It's Ikea. Okay. I'm hey. going to get my shipment one way or another. Oh, I remember this part. There was a lot of you have to, to kill attack the sniper? you here. Do you have to kill the sniper? I don't remember. There you you're are. the sniper. Where do you think you'll go? <laughs> Why are you get your hands off what of me? What are you doing? Stop it! Oh, Kill him! Man. Kill the Haitians! I completely forgot that it like auto-targets when you zoom in. That makes it well, way easier way to kill these guys. Easier. I was like fucking around too much earlier. That was my problem. Can't you climb why, up a little yeah, ledge, so you Why can't you get up there, dude? Because he's awkward. He's a weird Asian man. I mean, awkward in a social sense, because that's usually, but... Uh, come on, show your stink. 
B.O. lingers and it makes you think, because I'm Bo, yo. I'm the Raider Shepherd. I'm the Raider Shepherd. 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 Raider
fucking delicious. And Scott's <laughs> dick is still there. Uh, these treats are delicious, eh? eh? Yeah. He's eating a Twinkie. I don't need the... I don't need the... No, yeah, instead of a steak dinner, he's just at Mr. Grabs eating a Twinkie and Agent Smith. Is With like, a fork <laughs> and knife, exquisitely. <laughs> he's just like... Mm, you know, delicious. I know this treat is delicious and, uh, and full of uh, nice Vitamins cream and, and uh, buttercream. And yeah, these cocoa yeah, wheats yeah. are delicious for dessert, too. <laughs> Alright, get out of here, you. I'm tired of this. Get fuck off, you take this with me. <laughs> He's no, 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 stay down, toy. He's eating it like a link. Where, where are you going? Alright, he's good. I do like this gun, this is like an automatic shotgun. Pretty okay, nice. Tommy Lee Jones, I like this gun. <laughs> what is that? Men in black, dude. I like this he my gets favorite eaten. gun. Remember, he I'm gets going to get eaten. my gun back. Eat me! Yeah. I like this gun. You know, I think the reason that the, um... What's it called? Uh, Men in Black, the first one, works so well is because they, like, turn the whole idea about, like, the crusty old white guy and, like, hit the young black guy on its head by having Jay be the fuck up and he was, like, the one in control. Kinda. <clears throat> you know what I'm talking about? Uh, no. Yeah. Please explain this racist. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Shut up! I'm just kidding. Go ahead. No, but, like, it's always, like, uh... I'd like to see an, a trope of, like, the opposite. I don't know what you're talking about. Like... Uh, well, no, oh, like... Oh, are you talking about, like, the so, trope of, like, the black guy that's smooth and cool? Yeah. And, and the white guy's just yeah. like, I don't know that's, what's going on. Now you got um, it. You okay. actually heard what I said. Okay, I know <laughs> what you're saying. What? I feel like I keep running through the same spot. Uh, yeah. Follow the arrow. Go, reload, reload. Yeah, it is like time crisis, isn't it? Give me that head. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that. That's a... Use I'll the offensive like... grenade. It'll keep you offensive. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't mean to really use it. Motherfucker. Watch that explode and kill me. Keep going. I missile. didn't even see it explode. Where am I okay, going? Where's you're it? almost there. You're almost there. Okay, keep going. Oh, oh my god, so many friends. <laughs> they want to kiss you. With you their gun. I will use this right now. Oh my god. What the ping hell? Ping pong effect. Oh my god. Oh, it actually it worked. somehow hit something. It got Look, they're afraid. They're afraid. <laughs> <laughs> they're scared of Look, my Look, they're all distracted. They're not attacking anymore. They're all afraid of my cocoa wheats. You got three cocoa more of those to do that. <laughs> I like you going with the cocoa wheats joke. I'm like, dude, the most, the least scary thing. The only thing scary about cocoa wheats is how scarily bad they are to taste. I saw a video of a, a black guy making cocoa wheats and like he boiled um, the milk too much and it boiled over and he got really mad. Um, is this like where your boiled milk theory came from? Uh, kinda. It was, okay. during, it was like during that same period. Actually. Why was the black guy eating cocoa wheats? That's racist. It's cocoa. Bird brain. <laughs> Crunch. It's a cream pie <laughs> sandwich. Stop, stop, stop crunching them. I have to tell you, it's crunching. Stop crunching them. Boink. Stop picking his nose. I like boinking and punching. And Keep crunching. following, asshole. Keep Boink. following the arrow, asshole. Some of these are just like super satisfying. I love the cake. Okay, go to the right. right. I can't stop fucking doing them. Go right. Snack him on the stomach. Yes. Go away, yo. Shoot him, asshole. All right, keep going, asshole. This takes forever. Where the Eat fuck? Eat that tomato, am I? asshole. Hello. Have some, have some Boston. Have go some candy. What if I'm shooting Boston out of a gun? <laughs> oh, go to sneak. Have some candy. Otherwise known as Boston. Boston is illegal, but <laughs> I have some. <laughs> it's it's only given to wedding planners. He took some boss. It's marketed exclusively towards wedding planners with the boss. <laughs> <laughs> Gay wedding planners all this swear by it. Gay wedding planners in the 90s were Frog played by comedians who aren't relevant Honk? anymore. You're gonna wake me up honk in an hour? Honk. Oh man. Okay, you go. Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh, I am almost I feel there. a boss level is coming up soon. Good. <laughs> you made it. I'm still in a dream. I mean, it was a long, winding path, but you made it. Pretty fast. That was actually a good speed run. You didn't yeah. give up. Never surrender. Haven't you learned anything from that little girl in Pippa Longstocking? You believe it's something you never give up. Never surrender, never give up. Why galaxy do you have to start quest. singing it? The never galaxy ending world you wanna know. Aliens suck your dick with tents. I don't know. Hello? <laughs> Hello? I like, I, I try to pick the funniest part to cut it off. It doesn't always work hey, out. Nicholas! <laughs> My little butt. <laughs> Nicholas, <laughs> why are you drawing a drawing a furry? 
<laughs> Why are you drawing me in a face and uh, getting fucked by Sonic the Hedgehog? This is my private, like, McGee, notebook. Did, Sonic the Hedgehog is the coolest thing I know. <laughs> Chris, <laughs> he's fucking Nicholas Martin is like a furry. Uh, I mean, think about how McGee would react. Hey, Martin, I saw you deviant or not. I don't like that. <laughs> He's wearing a leather jacket now and smoking. McGee's just like, all right, Nick, we gotta talk. <laughs> Nick, uh, I'm we gotta talk about this. I can't deal with this anymore. I, I may be Irish, but I cannot I deal with this addiction. <laughs> I never thought about the fact that M McGee is Irish. Of course he is. The Martin family He's are. He's a leprechaun. They don't like seem like they're Irish. He's not a leprechaun. McGee isn't part of their family. He's not from their lineage. He's I know, but like, genetic. why does he draw a little Irish character? Because he was meant to be a leprechaun. Is he Irish Catholic? It. I'm. Well, actually, I can see that. I mean, is Martin a uh, Irish name? I'm not. I mean, it could be. Let's find out. Let's. You're absolutely right. Let's find <laughs> out. Uh, we're di we're digging into the lore. Of is Martin right now. as a last name a Irish name? Don't ask Siri. She doesn't know anything. Martin is Irish and Roman in origin. I guess they are Irish. Wow. That's where McGee came I from. I never really picked up on the fact that that was an Irish name. Well, McGee is pretty obvious, but Martin, I had no idea. I mean, we I all know about the, fa the famous... He pooped out a box when I killed him. Uh, <laughs> so we all know about the famous uh, Irish-American basketball player Shaquille O'Neal. Shaquille you know, O'Neal. I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> I'm never going to get tired of making that joke. Um... But I like that one. Basically, I own you. Technically. <laughs> oh, did I, um, I didn't tell you this, but it, uh, I might have sent you a picture, actually, but I got a, um, a new game. It's not a new game, it's a game on the Super Nintendo, but it's called uh, Michael Jordan Chaos in the Windy City. And it's a side-scrolling platformer where you walk around as Michael Jordan, like, throwing basketballs through hoops, and you can get fireballs and ice balls. And all kinds of, uh, like, special balls. And you go around rescuing other NBA players. The NBA players stole the talent from the uh, Looney Tunes, apparently. I can't deal with that. I don't even like Space Jam that much. I don't know why everyone thinks it's a great movie. It's not good. Okay, thank you. I, was like, I mean, I like it, but it's not good. I know you like it. I know Andy likes it. I know for reasons, but not like because it's a good movie, right? I mean, I mean, it's not. I just don't get anything. it. It's, it's just one of those movies that's so stupid. The fact that it exists is a joke in, in, in of, of itself. Kind of okay, I can, I can respect that. Like, that's why I think it's funny. Andy probably is like, Michael Jordan is actually nostalgia, like really good. Nostalgia is a factor. I get that. Like, that's, that's a thing. Especially the part where he goes, there you go, bugs. I hate that <laughs> Here you part. go, bugs. I hate that part. Can you just? Can you? Can you please? Can you play? Please. I remember when Brendan Fraser tried doing like a Looney Tunes back in action. Oh yeah, that was him. Wasn't I it? didn't see that movie, but Frater. it was so bad. What happened to him? Well, I didn't he get in a car accident or something, and it, it like fucked his brain up. I don't know if he got in a car accident, but I know that like doing like the, his own stunts from the Mummy really fucked his yeah, brain up. Yeah, something like, like that. He's like. Totally fucked up, and he has all sorts of problems now because he didn't like either get offered there, a stunt double or was. I feel bad, but like I, I don't remember any like super like crazy stunts from the mummy. Like what? What you know, it's was one of those it things that you probably don't realize how much went into it? You know what I mean? Because it seems so simple, but it might you have been, to do a take over and over again. It might be a simple jump down a hill, but you do yeah, it over yeah, yeah. and I mean, over I and over. And that's what I think what happened. Like it, it, it was like something so stupid. He was, he was probably maybe around our age at the time. Yeah, and, and it was like I can do this. And, and like, like I mean. I talk a big game and I'm like, oh yeah, I want to learn how to kip up and I want to learn how to do ninja shit. And but I know, don't like, think about what might in the back of my head, I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna do it like for one day and then I'm gonna take a week off doing it. That's exactly what I think would happen. You just didn't get a break. You kept doing it, and it was like, I mean, they're they. I mean, your 20s are like your prime years for doing that kind of thing. Oh pretty yeah. Much. Oh yeah. I mean. I mean, I wouldn't even say just even your 20s, too. I think your 30s are still pretty good, too. Because, like, I don't know if I told you, but I went skateboarding and grayling um, last weekend. And I hadn't picked up the board in probably a year, right? And I was like, all right, I'm going to board home. No, I, <laughs> I'm just kidding. But, like, I did take it out. And I, it took me, like, a half hour. But once that half hour was over and I was warmed up, I was like, everything came back like butter. I, like, I had my, like, what? butter. I mean, I was ollieing. I had my kick clips. I had. Well, all I took. I was able to like. I know. I, I was able like like to like skate around this park, no problems, and get pretty much back to where I was. I had my 50-50 grinds, board slides, five O's, and I mean, it was no big deal. But it did take me a half hour to get there. 
but that's all the difference was it was from 20. 20, you can jump right in it. You know, mm -hmm. 30, take a half hour to get ready. You know, <laughs> yeah. Simple as that. I was telling an old lady there. I was just like, yeah, you know, being you know being older, being 30 is now considered older. I feel like because it's just like I'm not. I don't feel old, but <laughs> 20 used everything to be takes. Like an hour when, when to people get ready. Were, like in the 50s when you were 20 years old you were like an adult what the fuck was that <laughs> <laughs> oh don't tell what me the to do fuck it all just happened oh if you're going all the way back then get another drink god Jesus. damn it yeah would you like a drink not no i don't want a nope. fucking drink nope, from nope, you no boogers sir no <laughs> no boogers bug free sir taste the bug flavor i know what's in there i guess i'll just sit here and quiet and play myself play me off johnny Stupid helmet wearing motherfuck. I'll choke you out and snap your neck at the same time. You can look at your ass while I kick it. Give me that. Go for a spin, fuck. Oh, nice little roll maneuver. I like when I kicked you in the face. I thought that was fun for me. I'm gonna take every gun from you. Give me all your guns. I'm bringing in the big guns, and now you all can just die individually. Take whatever they actually did. Die. What the fucking hell was that shit? You know, I think there's a lot of explosives everywhere. I think that's what my problem is. Don't throw any more grenades. Don't shoot the arrows anymore. Loading nuclear waste sector 2. This is like the beginning of Final Fantasy VII. We're blowing up a power plant right now. Hi. How much would it suck to be like a trained SWATman, but then like on your very first mission, some guy just sneaks up and even snaps your neck? That's too real. What if some like leather fetish having weird fuck? trench coat and sunglasses all the time just like came in and shot up your whole squad that would kind of make you feel like your training wasn't worth the time wouldn't it oh god ping pong ball yeah kick him in the stomach that's what you do how come you didn't die from that you also what happened to my like grenade gun thing that i had i don't remember so I'm trying to remember that episode of South Park you were talking about where like um, Mr. Um, Mr. Mackey was going around saying fag over and over again. What? He was just going to say fag, fag. No, no, that wasn't that wasn't Mr. Fag. Mackey. That wasn't Mr. Mackey. That was Mr. Garrison. Oh, sorry, Mr. Mr. Garrison is their bald feature, but Mr. Mackey's the guy with the like balloon head. Wait. Sorry, say that again. Who, who? Uh, the, their teacher is like, I'm Mr. Garrison, and he had yeah, uh, the big sucked in head, right? No, well, no, because Mr. Mackey had like a balloon head. They kind of look a little similar, but Mr. Mackey's the one who's always like, okay. Oh, I, yeah, no, okay. Trump is Gar, uh, yeah. Tr okay, Trump okay, is I played by Garrison on the show. I think I haven't watched any of the new episodes. Honestly, in a long time. Okay, now I get you now. Okay, okay, okay. I get you, I get you. Okay. Um, who is saying... Okay, so what happened? It was... Come on, man. Mr. Mr. Mackey? Yes. Uh, saying... mis no, Mr. Uh, Garrison was... Um, the one who is Trump or whatever. Yeah, and he kept on saying fag over and yeah. over again. And you're yeah. only allowed to say it if you're gay and or they, something. And they censored everyone else. Yeah, that was funny. I remember that episode. And he kept on saying like, fag, fag. And he's like, why is it not he's censored? Like, see, he got, see, he got <laughs> censored. Only gay people can say fag. <laughs> and then like, doesn't Uncle Jimbo say fag and it doesn't get censored? He's like, oh Jimbo, you're gay. I didn't know you're being fag. <laughs> it like outs people. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's why it was funny. It was I the episode, it. I think it was the episode where they kept saying shit over and over. Because, like, at the time, you couldn't say shit on television, so... Like, yeah, even uh, people did. Matt Stone and Trey Parker went to, uh... They Comedy went Central. to Comedy Central, and they were like, um... They were like, uh... We want to say shit, but we're only going to say it one time. And then the censors were like, oh, okay, I guess you're South Park, and you're, you know what you're doing, and you're really good at everything, so... Uh, they'd let him do it, but then, like, they, they, like, 
fucked over the sensors and they're just like, oh yeah, by the way, we're gonna say it like 600 times and not, not like one time like we said. But they didn't tell anybody that part, they just submitted the episode. Because they, they do it last minute every time, right? Yeah, they work till like... I watched the documentary just before. recently. It's really cool, like, those guys are awesome. Um, I it, really wish that... It really I, brings them down, like, like, they're humanized. Like, when I watched that, I was like, holy shit, they're not just, like, these geniuses. They, like... They are, they like... They stress out, like, everyone else. I would just, say like, that they're even, like, more of, like, ungenius here than guys like Matt Groning and stuff, because, like, he's kind of, like, let his IP go to shit, but they've always, like, stayed very close with what they do. Well, I had a lot more respect for, um, what do you call it, uh, for Matt Stone, because, you know, they always, of course, he's always given him, like, billing with him, like, it's always Matt Stone, Trey Parker. Yeah. And he said, he, he even said in the documentary, he was like, you know, I've gotten all sorts of, like, um, you know, like, directorial, like, requests to, like, do movies, like, crap movies that I probably wouldn't need anyway, uh -huh. but he's like, I rejected him because it's like, I had to tell him, like, you really don't know what you're doing, right? I, I, this is just me. I'm doing what Trey Parker tell, like. He's the genius. Like he's like the oh. brains of the operation. I kind of am just really good with him, so he keeps me along. You know what I mean? They were like, "Do you want to do a movie, Matt Stone?" And he's like, uh, "I don't want some game I mean, or nothing." But <laughs> Trey Parker's actually the really well, smart one. You know what I'm one. saying? He could easily say like, "You know, I'm just as funny as Trey. I'm just as funny as Trey." But he's just like, yeah. "No, no, no." Like he is. Well, he's the bro. Like I just. I you think know. they're like a team, right? I mean, but yeah, but like he admitted it right there, like he was like, was like I can't do this without him. Child kind of stuff. Yeah, he pretty he gave him his like credit where it was due. He was like, I'm not gonna go off and do something without Trey Parker because that's not how it works for us, you know. Mm -hmm. That's cool. To me, to me, I just I don't know. I thought they were both kind of like trying kinda to like fight us. their own independence. Like, I'm the secret talent, but you're like the, <laughs> the willing cohort. Kinda. I wouldn't call you the secret talent. You eat <laughs> bugs for a living. That's the like, funniest thing I've ever yeah. seen in my life. It's delicious. I didn't even complain about it. I don't even make you feel bad about it. I mean, you feed. You literally are feeding me bugs. I got you McDonald's. I brought you donuts today. It's protein. Look at that. The oh the neck. See if if this were you and me, I'd have that hair, but you you would be like. Look at the neck. See that scrawler. <laughs> No, 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 no. Yes, yes, yes. What about Drew Carey? <laughs> what about him? <laughs> I was waiting for you to be like, that's a non sequitur, you dumbass. They're the cool. Oh, I got it. He's got the green. <laughs> He's got the green. They're the cool. Why is Niobe going to somewhere where I haven't cleared it yet? Uh, she trusts you to have skills. I got skills. Uh, skills. You better chiggity check uh, yourself before you riggity wreck yourself. Stop burping. I couldn't stop, stop man. Burping. That came out of nowhere. Oh, there's one left. There was two, and now there's one, and then I see him. And then there was one. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> Here. Woo! SWAT team incoming. Get the sniper! When I see incoming, I think of, um... Where's my guns? I don't have them anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Hit the select button. Hit delete. You, you need those mainframes! You know how much data you lost there, you idiot? That was my son's college fund! Those are my family photos! <laughs> On the cloud, Whoa. you dick! I hope he needs my help. Why do I have to do this? <laughs> oh, this is one of those, like, retreat and go back, retreat and go back. It's like, <laughs> you know, break it and give back. <laughs> I, I know I sounded like that when I said that. Those were two of the best, like, one-time characters they've ever had in that show. Look, well, because Eric owns them. He's just like, you guys are idiots, and you're destroying the whole party! <laughs> and they're just like, don't make him feel bad. I don't make him feel worse. Yeah. Why don't you just give us our money back and we'll leave? Look familiar. <laughs> Sound familiar? Bazap. Bazap. Nope, bez there's not an electric gun. Stop, shut up. Wait, no, wait, wait. No. You can you can actually throw them into those electrical thingies and then they get hurt. The conduits? Yeah. Do it. The zap. Didn't happen. He just. I don't remember how to do it, but you can like toss them in. I never room. saw that. I don't believe it. You know what? You take that. If you just want to blow those up so you can throw them in there. <laughs> I pooped them out. I Go! Oh. Go! Go! Run in slow motion. No, I almost forgot some money. <laughs> did you okay. remember Beer Fest? Oh, forgot some money. Yeah, I forgot I some money. I love that movie. Those are Deutschmarks. I told you. I don't know. Wasn't the Deutschmark worth, worth like way less than... Uh... 
Well, Deutschmarks weren't even in production at that point. Everyone was on the Euro. Like, everyone's on the one standard. Yeah, so it was, like, not worth anything. Yeah, it wasn't worth anything. Come he on. said, I told you to get Deutschmarks. And he's like, no, Deutschmarks, no. Fuck you. No, fuck you. Offensive grenade. I'm going to throw more offensive this <laughs> I love that name, Offensive Grenade. Like, they couldn't have even predicted how bad that is going to end up. <laughs> His hands are all over the place. <laughs> you killed all those servers. I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! Goddamn kids. Simon, bitch. <laughs> this is great! My balls just turned into <laughs> okay. This is great! Ah! Where did that come from when they got in the water? Uh, that was what he said. <laughs> and, uh, okay, it's like, okay, this bomb is going to turn them all into raisins. <laughs> <laughs> he activated the time machine. This is like, we don't have to do any editing, you're doing it already. <laughs> I like doing that. <laughs> the cut short? Where, where you cut the cutscene cut short, yeah. There's a lot of funny things. Like, we should do that when we play Metal Gear. The Nobi, the Niobe, the thing is that, no, that is not Solid Snake, that is... <laughs> <laughs> well, we can make our own story. Good shit. Let's get Boink. 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 I have this. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect. Perfect way of doing it. Here you know, I, I don't care what you say. Before I die, I will make, like, a missed style game a day in life like that. Yeah. Yeah. I already started to, but I didn't Starting get far me. because I was using Python. And I, don't, I don't think I'm going to use Python. I'm going to switch to JavaScript or something. I, Unity would be much better for it. What is this guy doing here? Hello. This is what happened when uh, Channel Awesome got accused of abusing women in like, storm their office. They're <laughs> 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 under arrest for reviewing those movies in that fashion. Oh, here's the boober gun. <laughs> you have no longer any power over us. Uh, I can imagine Doug Walker making like a shitty version of the Matrix just with that very concept. Oh like my God. the SWAT person in his office, he's like. Ah, goodbye! I'm the nostalgia critic. I couldn't even... I'm, and then he, like, pulls out God. two guns, and he makes his stupid, squirrely, angry face, and then he starts, like, flipping all over the place, and it's, like, slow motion, but it's awful. Did you ever see that fight he did with the angry video game nerd, where they, they were, like, they met in the nerd's basement, and you could tell, like, the angry video game nerd, or James Rolfe, or whatever, didn't want to do it, really, but he did it anyway to, like, just satiate Doug Walker and make him leave him alone. <laughs> No, I didn't see that. What did that why. say? Oh god, it's a ninja! It's he's, an detecti agent. he's detecting an agent. He's That's an agent! He's an agent! He's flipping! I think, yeah. I, I think I have to fight him. Uh, yeah. I think so. Oh, I remember what to do. Throw him into the... the yeah, yeah, yeah. That's exactly that's what you right. were talking. So that's where that's you got that from. That's why I knew you had to do something like that. Here. Okay, that's where you got it from. Oh, he had that point blank in your face. Really? Knock the agent into that the was spark. That was you. Sorry. Okay. How fitting, a fitting end. Go in there. Yeah, see? Zap. You're dead. Oh, you're right. Okay. He's got a cool gun. That's actually really cool oh, that you remembered that. Yeah, it, and it told me right after I remembered. I know, but that's cool. You proved that you knew it ahead of time. You had it before you got that even. It's time for my birthday party. Here comes the big baboon. Where's my party at? Happy birthday to me. Happy Do you remember um, at Karen's Creations? In Master Control. Do you remember Karen's Creations? There used to be, like, mm -hmm. a whole rack of, like, birthday cards that were naughty birthday cards. Do you remember that shit? Oh! What? <laughs> do, do you remember there used to be, like, a whole rack of birthday cards at Karen's Creations that were, like, dedicated to, like, naughty birthday cards? No. I don't. Like, they were not... They were like Men adult. For kids. Yeah, they were oh, like adult themed. Dude, yeah, there was a giant. Like, Have you gone in there recently? No, I, I refuse. Does she recognize you? She'll, I, that's she'll the thing. recognize she you. Will. She will. And that's why I don't want to go in there. You should, like, do your hair in a different style or something and then put, like, the COVID mask on and then walk in. Oh, yeah, no, she might not recognize me for that, yeah. Yeah, just, like, wear a mask. It's like, that's what you're supposed to do nowadays. Anyway, before we get too off the track, calling there me. was a. There was a, uh, what the fuck? This Sarah, you gotta fight him. Anyway, so there was a whole card rack, and there was birthday cards, and I was reading them, and one of them was like a straight up picture of a dick with a face with eyes and a mouth, mm -hmm. and it said, happy birthday, dickhead, on the front, and then the inside it said, 
Now put on your party hat, and it was a fluorescent green colored uh, condom in there. And I'm like, this is at Karen's Creations. <laughs> Another yeah. one was there was a chick with really big tits, like in a shower with soap over her nipples. And it said, our bodies are 90% water in the front. And inside it said, good thing you had those big jugs to hold it all in. I was Very like, nice carry. why is this at the store? You're Maybe fucking you it up. <laughs> oh, no, yeah, yeah, is that fucking it up? Is that fucking it, it up? No, you need to, no, you, yeah, you need to oh, do yeah. that. Counter it. Do it. Do that more often. Just do that again. Come on. Over and over again. Come on, man. Come on, man. Look, man. Look, Don't fat. fight me in a fucking tea house, man. What the fuck? Come this on, guy man. is corn pop. You have to okay. fight him. And this guy is corn he's pop. He's not orange or he's not yellow enough. He hit, no, pop. he hit the he hit, he hit the popcorn button. Now you have to. You're gay. Wait, are you supposed to? <laughs> I. You're gay. I don't know. <laughs> that worked out perfect. I don't know. So you lost to me. Whoa. This is what I love living. Did that like own. fuck your TV up. For I don't a give second? a shit. I love. I love living in my own house. I can do what the fuck I want now. Parents just break like, bottles over my own Ugh. head. I can kill myself. I don't even care, dude. I don't even care. Whoa. One thing that pisses me off that Susie wants me to take my shoes off when I come into the house, and I'm like, no, I refuse. I refuse. Nope. This so is, the compromise was that I would sweep and mop every other day if I was allowed to wear my shoes in the house. <laughs> so I do that. You should have like a swap and stop in your house where you take the mystery eggs and then you can like leave them with the chicken and then she hatches and gives you a chicken. What the fuck is this shit? Just don't turn around. I'm I'm facing the swarm already. Just don't turn around. Okay. Get away from me! Is this the very end? This must be the very I end. I thought it was. Yeah, but this I thought like there was the another... first movie ended. I could have sworn there was another level. Yeah, me too. Go I ahead. thought there was a level where you had to like fight a smith in like a in like a sky rise kind of tower. Now turn around and see if it works. I wonder if maybe that's only in the harder difficulty or something. But hey, if this is the end, that's fine with me. I have my fill. I have my fill. I got to fight vampires and werewolves in the same day. <laughs> when at what point do these these machines give up? These squiddies. Squiddies. They give you a kiss and you don't they fail. Give you day. Don't let him kiss you. There's a lot of them. Holy shit. What would it, wouldn't it be interesting if like there was like an evil plot to take over the world where like the, the machines were trying to turn all the humans gay so they never wanted to recreate or, like, That wouldn't work for them. Well, well, I guess, what would I guess you advantage? could artificially inseminate I'm trying to figure out where there would be an advantage then. Uh, nobody wants to like, the human race is just going to die because they don't want to mate. Yeah, but they need this to is, have like, the, the most energy from their bodies. Let's, let's talk about something else. What? You, you just what, backed what? yourself in a corner. That look, made look no fat. sense. I know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Don't believe anything I say, honestly. I'm full of shit. You sound like like all, like literally all the gay people that I ever met were like they want they want to turn everyone else gay. <laughs> it was like what? <laughs> yeah, like it was like that's no, I've never no, heard I mean, anyone say that. I don't that. want to put it that way. That sounds bad. <laughs> okay, so for example, like um. I had, I had a manager that was like, you know, calling, he was trying to call in one of our workers who was gay, and they're really cool, both of them are really cool with each other. And he was just like, hey Paul, I need you to come in. And he's just like, no, I don't want to, Joe. You know, like, I don't want to, I, I, I have stuff to do, I, I'm on on call, I don't have to anything. Why are you being gay? And then, no, yeah, <laughs> and, and he said something like that, he's just like, no, you're being gay, Paul, come on. He's like, you're gay. He's like, no, you're gay, Paul. He's like, no, you're gay, uh, what's his name, uh, Joe. Rodrigo. Like, you're, you're gay, Joe. <laughs> if there was a dick in front of you, you'd suck it. And then he's like, whoa, whoa, that went too far. Okay, wait, no. Wait, so the, not, the gay guy actually said that to the non-gay guy? Yeah, like, they went through three, like, arguments of, like, you're gay, you're gay, you're gay. And then all of a sudden, the gay guy said, you're gay. You, you, you know, if there was a dick in front of you, you'd suck it. And then all of a sudden, the straight guy was like, whoa, 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 no, 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 okay, no, no, this went too far. Okay, this okay, went too uh, far. Yeah, he's yeah. like, dude, he's like, I don't care, but dude, like, you can't do that, you can't do that, like. <laughs> Man. I miss those days where you could just, like, say whatever you wanted. And as long as you, everyone in the room was well, an adult, care it wasn't a big deal. He didn't care either, but he was just like, dude, I'm on, I'm like, he was on a company phone. That was the difference. Like, he wouldn't have given a shit, but, like, he was just like, dude, I'm calling you from work. <laughs> like, stop it, stop it, what the hell? It's, it's crazy to me, like, how much things have changed in a short period of time, like, in the 90s. Uh, yeah, I remember when you used to be able to hang out with Sabrina at a house party, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> most of Joan Hart. What was that one uh, movie? Most of Hart. I know, right? And then she brought a Heart wiggly, rub. jiggly flan, and then you ate the flan with her. 
What was that movie though she was in with uh, uh, Seth Green? Like, it was like the quintessential 90s movie. Seth Green was dressed as a snowboarder. Uh, oh, it you know was, what I'm talking um, about? Yeah. That's a good movie, actually. What's it yeah, called? It's, it's, like, I think it's, it's like, like a timestamp. Can't stamp. hardly wait. Yes, That's it was a timestamp. Like that was. It like... had the kid from Hook. Yes, the, yes. The kid from Hook. Oh my and god. He does this awesome scene where he like gets on stage and starts singing, uh, "Sweet" or not "Sweet Home Alabama." What was it? Paradise uh, City. Uh, was it Paradise City? I oh, think for so. Some reason, I thought it was. Take yeah, you're right. That's what it is. City. You're right. That was such a cool scene. It was I like, almost said it was. She looks like she has bounds. I want to be sedated, but it wasn't. You're right. It is Paradise City. You're right. Yeah. I was like, what happened to that kid? And that movie answered that question. You know, he was there. That's what happened. That I was, was, that was that kid reminded me of you, actually, when you were a kid. I think I had, Spring, I had kind of floppy summer, hair. Summer, winter, fall. What is the problem? You know, like... What? Oh. What about Bob? Well, oh, yeah. That, that was him. That was the same kid, too. I forgot. Spring. Spring, I guess summer, it's... winter, fall. What's the difference? <laughs> that was a cool move. I like Hook because it does have all four seasons all at once. Oh man, it's still going. <laughs> I hate this part. Just don't turn around. Just keep going. There is, I'm not controlling anything. All I can do is shoot. Just don't turn around. What are you about if you me? turn around, I shall. For every time you turn around, I shall kill you. You turn around the game. You turn around real life. <laughs> <laughs> You have a stroke in... Okay, no, no. Okay, sorry. Sorry, Frankie. I like you. I like uh, you a lot. Bro, Frankie. I, hope, I wish his legs didn't get all fucked up. What? They're fucked up now? I know he, he, he was like he a race car remember. driver or something. I remember that. Out. And I remember Shit. he had a stroke and he doesn't even remember doing the series. That's sad. Now he's paralyzed? No, he's not He's not paralyzed, but like his knees are all fucked up. Like he lost... Like, he got in some kind of accident or something. He, he drove race cars. He hit the wall. And then, and did you hear recently what happened? He no, was, like, no. in a band. Uh, he, like, finally found a band, and the band actually started to get kind of, like, popular. But then, like, his band members, like, hated him because everyone knew their band is the band with Frankie, Frankie Muniz. Frankie Muniz. So they kicked him out of this is the band. Oh, my God. And what he, dick? And he doesn't even remember it, too. So he can't no. even say, like, you know, like, you assholes. He's just like, what? What, uh, what the fuck is it? You know, like... What is the problem? Life is, un life is unfair. Shit! Oh, <laughs> you Get asshole! Off. You asshole! <laughs> I guess that's his life story. Is, did you make that up or is that? No, that I. Okay, as far as I know, that's fitting. actually true. It seems the, way the, too I fitting. I think the, the the band thing is actually true, but that's kind of that kind of sucks. I really like Malcolm in the Middle. That show doesn't really get enough. Nowadays, I want to say but... that I liked Mac in the Middle, but I really liked that brain hacking thing in the beginning of the movie of the series. What uh, the fuck are you talking the about? The brain hacking uh, clip in the intro. What? Oh, yeah. The... Okay. Yes. yes. And it's chocolate. also in earnest. Yes, the brain hacking intro. I actually watched that whole movie, you know that? Uh, yeah, earlier tonight with me. And then no, you fed I me mean, like, the brain drink. movie. I don't remember what it's actually called, but... Oh, yeah, um, yeah. I, was, I, I always wanted to know that. Wasn't it called, like, The Brain from Planet yes, Nine or something? Yes, it was. Actually, you're right. That's actually what it was. I mean, like Wait, no, I, I guess. That can't be right. <laughs> no, it's, like, The Brain from Planet Nine? Well, Planet Nine from Outer Space is probably what I was thinking of, but I think it's called The Brain from Outer Space or something. Let's look up this. Okay, The, the Brain from brain. Chopping, chopping Brain. Just Google Chopping Brain Movie from Malcolm in the Middle and Ernest. Brain. Let's see what Google comes up with. Yeah, everyone's brought this up. That's how I found it, actually. Brain chopping. The guys, just showing a little brain. What's the problem? Brain chopping. Get off of me. How do I get off? How do I get off? Stupid squiddies. Level blast forever, and it's so stupid. It's like a rail shooter, and it's not even good at it. It's not brain chopping movie. You gotta look up movie. Brain from, movie. brain from Space Movie. Let's look it up. Evil Brain from Outer Space? No, that's not it. No, that's not it. Am I just gonna, like, kill the entire squid army by myself? I haven't even died. This is all just, like, one part. Oh, fuck. They're gonna do a bunch of bullshit when I all of a sudden. What the hell? What, what does that mean? The squiddies are gonna get you if you don't win. You I better think they're, win. They're, Throwing something at me, aren't they? Oh god. You better look, look out. out. Oh god. You ought to look out. Reload, 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 reload. I don't like that it's doing the beeping at me right now. Yeah, I don't know what it means. 
Just act like you know what you're talking about, dude. You're doing good. <laughs> what are you doing? That's, that's making me very anxious. I don't like that. Get off. Come on, man. They're acting like they like know what they're talking about, they don't. Oh god. You ever heard that Donald, Donald Trump song by uh, that rapper that died? Uh, the rapper that died? No. So, define irony, right? Oh, I'm this sorry. Remind me after Mac we... Mac Miller? Oh, well, remind me after we finish this, I gotta show you the Buttercream Gang rap thing that we had. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're asking about. But go ahead with your story. So, Mac Miller is a, is a Jewish rapper, right? He made a song called Donald Trump, and it, it was all about being rich and just, like, fuck, you know, fuck bitches, get money, and it was really popular. It was one of his most popular songs. Oh, yeah? And then Donald Trump got elected as president, and he, like, went and on this... like, oh, he, now he's yeah, a racist. Yeah, he, he said, you racist motherfucker, you know, you know, motherfucking politic piece of shit, I denounce your, you know, piece of shit life, and... Oh, my God. And then, and then he died, Mac Miller died of a heroin overdose. <laughs> oh, like, I know, it's like one of those things you don't want to laugh, it's like, well, well, it, no, well it, you I need mean, to trust you for an opinion. It's not that he died, it's just kind of like, yeah, okay, heroin, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, like, okay, <laughs> you're, you're so. Obvi you obviously are, are a pretty decent person if you're I don't want to spread heroin. this misinformation, but I want to make sure, because I know he died prematurely of something, it was drug related, but I want to make sure it was heroin, I don't know, like. I don't know if I'm actually hitting this thing. I gotta shoot this little bug. You haven't died. Like, uh, I mean, uh, you're still just making it through, right? If you're not. Uh, James was known as Mac Miller, was an American rapper. Uh, died in the 2018. And he was really cool for a while. Mac Miller. Let's see. What did he die of? Let's figure it out. So it's Family Robinson, baby. Good lord, I can't even see this thing. It's so far away. A uh, bug. Am I, am I still shooting it? Where is it? Maybe Miller was found unresponsive in the Studio City home by his personal assistant who called 911 to perform secure. Um, he had been scheduled for a video shoot on the same day of his death and was to embark on a swimming tour. Are you just hitting one button? I literally, yeah. Uh, I don't know if I'm actually hitting the thing that I'm supposed to be shooting at, but there's this tiny little bug thing that's chasing me. Oh, look at this. Okay, so Mac Miller, it was determined that he died from an accidental drug overdose due to a drug, a mixed drug toxicity of fentanyl, cocaine, and alcohol. How do you accidentally mix those up? You <laughs> fucking gerbil. Fucking asshole. Idiot. I don't is care it, what is anyone there, says. Uh, is, there, is there like a little sub thing at the end that says, by the way, Donald Trump is racist? <laughs> He removed his song rightfully because Donald Trump is racist. By the way, he he may have died. No, I'm sure it's in there. And it says that his... he denounced Donald Trump and all his like association with him. It's like, oh, guess what? But the main hook of the song was, look at all this Donald Trump shit. Ain't that some shit? And it was like it was all about being rich and like fuck bitches, get money. Like, and then as soon as Donald Trump actually started getting somewhere with the presidential race, he was like, fuck you, you racist piece of shit. And then he won. It was like, oh my god. And then he died. <laughs> I, was like, I really don't Donald get Trump was just like, uh, I, I get, fuck you, I, I you get piece the whole, of shit. <laughs> I get the whole, like, grab him by the pussy thing and, like, how, like, that's kind of a bad thing to say. But, yeah. like, I don't get where the racist stuff comes from. Like, because he wants to build a wall to keep illegal immigrants out, right? I, I'm sorry, we shouldn't get political like this. No, 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 no <laughs> this, this is a legit thing. I'm not going to go into that. I just, I, I get what you're saying. I just want to say I don't get that either. But one thing I'm not, I'm not happy with is, like, during the last debate, he said... They said, do you denounce white supremacy? And he didn't. I was like, what is your problem? I thought he did say it. He didn't. No, he just said, uh, he said, proud boys stand back and stand by. Yeah, and he said stand by. That was kind of weird. He refused to actually just say, I denounce white supremacy. That's all he no, needed to say. But just no, he has denounced it a million times before, though. Is that what the problem is? It's like, he's just they, like, they I don't ask him. To... They keep on asking him over and over, and he keeps on saying it. But I thought it was weird how he phrased it in that particular instance that you're talking about. So maybe about. that's what it was then. Because I do know what you're talking about. Because I remember he said, like, he's just like, who do you want me to say? Like, who specifically do you want me to denounce? Like, what, what's going on? And it was like, they said, okay, what about the Proud Boys? And he's like, okay, Proud Boys, stand back and stand by. And I knew that, like, I knew that was probably by, on the cough. Yeah. He was probably just saying, like, hey, guess what? Oh, we beat it. What the hell? I thought there was another level that we just didn't do. <laughs> that this was kind of weird. sucks! The ending, no, the ending really sucks. The ending is literally a little bug that chases you. Couldn't they have let me fight Smith or something? No. 
It can't be over. Did it say executive producer Grant Hill? Yeah. Execu executive producer Stuart Little. I can't, no, we, we finished it? That makes me sad. Well, yeah, I know. This must like, have been like one of the last games that Atari actually made. Did a pink <clears throat> Smith. I love this game. And then he's wrong. I miss this game. I miss going to the beach. Well, you could you could always play through as Niobe. It's pretty much the same as that game, though. Lawrence Fishburne. Fuck. Carrie Ann Moss. Yeah, hack it. Hack the game, though. Yeah, overrate it. <laughs> yeah, you're just like telling me to do stuff. Yeah, yeah hack right. the Matrix, Ben. All right, let's go into the Matrix. Hack let's, it. Let's go. Can explain to me what the hell's actually going I on. I have no idea, but we're gonna find out. But we're gonna do some Unix hacking, I think. Yeah. I actually understand a lot more about this, I think. Ben you know. is actually the, the part no, that I think I'm not the were... brains of this operation, dude. I have no idea. I'm the brains of this operation? Tell Mr. Moroni if he wants to kill a public servant. He's got to buy Chinese. They never told us anything about this, okay? Press Just... enter. Shift. Okay. Shift key. Okay. Would D. you be interested in paying liability insurance? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm from Earth. Hi, I'm from Earth. Have we met? I don't think so. <laughs> I remember going through this, I don't know, I'm just going through the different, oops, I'm supposed to do a CD system. This is going to work, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so, wait. Why does it say CD system? You got a CD, and then where's space? This is so weird that they put this in. This I don't is actually like hacking. You... I used to love, this is what got me into like where I am right where now. Where do you see that you're supposed to put in CD? Um, no, this is like a Unix system. Like, this is exactly like how a Unix system would work. All right, where's, enter. See? Oh, wait. No, what the fuck? Gear? Okay, sit. Oh, now you can get... Okay, you have to use the left-hand command. They cheat. All right. They give you little shortcuts. Directory of A system. Reboot. I don't want to reboot. CLS just clears it. Login. What's login? I don't know what you're doing right now, little kid. But you're special. I know. Man. I'm just... <laughs> Oops. Right. Uh, login... Let's just find out. I don't Give know. Give me the map, Scott. Give me the map, Scott! I'll never be able to figure out what I'm doing right now, but I just want to see if I do anything. Like, I figured this out on my own. Oh, shit. Um, yes. Yes? What if I typed in no spoon? Did, uh, you want, you want to hear something interesting about that game I was telling you about earlier? The, uh, Marvel oh, game? Oh, shit. Sorry, go ahead. Uh, the Marvel game, uh, so the main girl in it, Kamala Khan, Miss um, Marvel makes her hands grow real big. <laughs> uh, there's a part in that game where she's hacking into Tony Stark's, like, private server or something, and she has his login, but she doesn't have his password, so she has to guess his password, and she only gets three tries. Guess what his password is. Uh, password? No, it, well, I think, what does she try first? She tries, like, it, it, she gets a hint that it was uh, the first love of Tony Stark's life. So she uh, said, first she tries um, Pepper Potts, and that doesn't work. And then I think she tries Iron Man, and then that doesn't work. And then the third guess is, I am Iron Man. And oh, that's the password. God. That's Tony Stark's password. No, no, like, scripted language whatsoever. No, like, uppercase, lowercase, like, variation or numbers or symbols or anything. It's just that. And I was like, what the fuck is this game? Okay, let's find out. I found out how to get cheat codes, but I don't know how to use it. Let's see. We can't even win when we cheat. Okay, let's find out what we got here. Okay, enter. I'm trying to figure out what's going cheat on. Cheat DK here. mode. <laughs> well, that would be cool for this game. I don't want to. I don't want this movie, to, this game, to end. There's still a separate campaign with the girl that you can play as. Fuck that shit. <laughs> no, I'm Fuck that. I don't want to be black. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. Why do you have your matched luggage out here? What? Oh, that's got my like life's history in there, actually. <laughs> it's like your your Jimmy lunchbox from the. From uh, the wizard. Actually, that's got like the VHS tapes that my uncle and moved over to VHS. I was like, let's see what the little mutants got, and then I rip it out of your little fingers, and then I open it up right in front of you and pour it out, and they're like, what the hell is this? There's just a half-eaten apple core and pictures of Susie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What's wrong with that? Uh, 
Oh, shit. Then you can fix any computer, but you can't fix your friendships. Let's look at this. Okay, so... F F F F F F F one. Why? Why? Invisibility. Stop sends me from seeing you. What's the the um the thing for the sword? Do the sword. I'm trying to find it. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just going down the line of cheats here. Let's just get these cheats down. Okay. Let's see. You would uh, never guess these cheats though in real life. No, this isn't like what you're supposed to know in the game. This is just like you look it up. Okay. Seven eight six. All weapons. Okay. Seven eight. Six, seven. I think it's interesting that they actually put F4, all this F4, in the three. game. Like, they could have just had a regular old cheat mem menu, but they're like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, I, what happened when you were fighting Trinity? I missed that whole part. Um, I beat the fuck out of her because she's a girl and her weight classes are for a reason. Pun you used her boobs as punching bags and you whipped out your boober gun and blew her boobs in part. Yeah, you really have no idea how this works, do you? No, it's, <laughs> it's you it's, don't know the technicalities. The weight classes of the exist gun. for a reason. Okay, I'm just kidding. You don't know the technicalities. One, of the D, gun. You did not beat them. Double D F eleven ninety two twelve two five five six. I'm just going down the line. Buzz, don't be a moron. Faster logo speed flight. That's I have no pointless. idea what that is either. What's logos? It's a stupid ship you fly at the end of the game. Oh, is it? We're never going to play that part again. I have no idea. Stupid logos. Um, Pathos. Logos. Okay, Ethos. let's see. Six, nine. Six, one, nine. Oops, we got to do the cheat first. Cheat. Okay. Booyaka, booyaka. Six, six, nine. Ha! E5B. Past. Sex mode unlocked. This is not, you know... The hot coffee mod. Oops. I want the sword. Five. Okay, yeah. Isn't there a the... multiplayer that's hidden? That's what I'm trying to get to. Okay, okay. But we e can't five. play it because you only have one controller. I know. That sucks. I could have brought one too. These are the kind of things you need to remind me about. I'm sorry. I'm a failure. I fed you bugs too. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I fed you bugs, Nicholas. Next time I'll blend them into the water. Servo mode. Fast mode. Multiplayer. Okay. Here we go. Cheat. Cheat. D. On five. D life. C55. Five. You know what I need to play that I just re completely remembered out of the blue when you typed D5 was, uh, you remember D2? We played D and then we played Enemy Zero. We should play D2. Oh my god. Yeah, we should play that. Fuck, dude. Enemy Zero is really, really good. That's on, uh, Sega Laura. Saturn. Laura. Laura. That's a fucking scary game. I almost game. forgot about that. Holy shit. But no, that's D. But there's a game I don't think we did play together. It's called Enemy Zero. So all the enemies in the game are invisible. And you have to like use this shitty little gun to uh, like shoot them as they come up to you. And uh, you can't see them until they get really close. But you have this motion detector and it makes this really creepy sound. It would probably f make you like freak out if you played it. But... Really cool. So you did just unlock multiplayer. Fashta logos. Infinite. Oh, it doesn't work. What is that? Uh, I'm trying, trying to find the sword. Okay, yeah, where is... I know there was a sword. I remember there being, like, samurai... Or not samurai, uh... But yeah, samurai. Tours. Cool. Direct is not... Is it... Okay, exit? No. Goblins don't exist. Goblins don't exist. What is this? I don't. I have no idea where I'm at. I want to like go back, and this does not. Go back to what? Like a current directory. It's just a dear, and I can't. Like, this is not how it really works. Ben, I have some bad news for you. This is a PS2 game. And it's kind of glitchy and buggy and shitty in a lot of ways. So it might not be an actual Unix system. Yeah, that's sad. Sad but true. Okay, let's see. Where's the sword? Okay, cheat codes. I'm a little sad now that I uh, sold, um, what's it called? Path of Neo. Because apparently that's a pretty well-regarded game now. What game? Path of Neo. You sold it, you little shit. <laughs> you sold it. I sold it to line my pockets with stinky, good, smelly cash. 
Echo reboot works. Uh, remove unlocked commands. Uh, cheat vibration chest. Okay, you can just <laughs> vibration mode active. Make the controller vibrate uncontrollably. Wait, let's just. I don't know. This is like I have no idea what you're doing right now. This is like where I work with daily, and it doesn't make sense. Okay, beep. Okay, you can play a song. Beep eight five three one. Let's try it. I've never done this before, actually. So this is music you can play. Beep eight five three. Oops. One. No. Wrong button. Eight five three one. Let's try that. Is it gonna be the, like the main theme of the song? Maybe it's maybe maybe it's Neo. I know one is you can get a message from Neo and Morpheus actually. Do do a go go Power Rangers like. Dee, 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 dee. Didn't you have that as your text tone for a while? Uh yeah, I did actually for a long time. I remember that actually. I like okay. those little things like that. No, this is okay. But well, let, let's play some funkadelic music while you're doing this. <laughs> I found some more stuff. Okay. Do you want some treats? Where'd you get this? This is the song, this is Pete's entrance. How did you get this? Apparently someone else likes the Buttercream Gang out there. This is awesome. <laughs> fuck a book, fuck a book. Where to find me, yo? The remix. So the, the first verse has this like white guy rapping and it kind of sucks, but the second verse is really good. I love the second verse, and that's what's coming up next year. We've been listening to this a lot. Oh, that's actually Got a 65 and pile of trunk full of buttercream. That's what the end felt. Touchdown. Buttercream. Can't you please tell me where to find me? Maybe it's gone in a fairy tale with those dreams of a baby. I don't really like this part either.
Oh, Jesus. This is a really... Like, this is a really long way to get... Like, I'm not doing this. I didn't say you had to. I know, it's just it's insane. If I'm looking through it, it says... Select tools from the B drive. It will be locked and it will ask you for an access code. The access code consists of ones and zeros. You must guess the access codes code as oh. it is different each time. It is only five digits long. Just play the game now and like use your cheats that you used. Fuck it. Go back to the chateau. Can I like open those up? No, I can't. Okay, so let's just I know you got the sword somehow. What sucks is it doesn't save any of the cheats. Yeah, it does. I don't think it does. It asks me every time I leave. No, but I, I, don't, I think when you shut the game off, it doesn't save them. Well, we'll find out. We will definitely find out, my friend. The game will just freeze and be crappy. No. <laughs> what? Go back. Not this part. No, I... No, no, no. Go hit it, and then... I'm going back. Okay. Then, yeah. Yeah. Load. Load. And now click the thing. And then... Like, scroll left. There you go. Oh. I, I didn't want you to pick the very end of the game. The Chateau is the one with all the vampires. Closing time. I like this one. You don't have to go home, but we can't. Jack and... Jack and Mega Man EXE trans. You don't have to go home, but you can deposit your alcohol. So finish your whiskey and beer. Or wine, or <laughs> or Jack anything because and we're Coke, or we're a business else, here. We accept all gin, alcoholics. Juice, yes, meth. Closing heroin, time. Keep snorting. Everyone's heroin. got a drink, so you just finish your whiskey. This is crack, <laughs> not right. cocaine. It Where isn't glamorous or cool. Okay, how would you? Oh, wait, you already got your weapons, so you go left and right to change your weapons. There you go. Is that all you have? What the fuck? Maybe, that maybe should I be all you have. I, I said I unlocked all weapons. Uh, I mean, you were there, right? I did see that, yeah. But you do have a couple of weapons. Normally you only have like one. Go shoosh them. No. You don't have shit. Makes sense. I, this game just it doesn't make sense. What if you were closing at your job and then all of a sudden some Asian man started doing cartwheels in the lobby? And shooting at you? And shooting at you and slamming your head into the pavement. Like so much force. These are lowly civil servants and the Matrix people just come in and act like they hate the place. I have 100% focus. Look at them, they can't get through the door! It's gotta be this level, because I have 100% focus. So you can, just, you can just focus forever. Yep, I'm doing it. Yeah, and you got infinite ammo. Woo! You flipped off of a screen that you blew up. They don't- what the, they're not reacting to anything. They can't even see it because I'm not supposed to have this at this point. Fuck yeah. you. <laughs> hey, are you shooting everybody? Oops. Did you just quit the game? Let's do this game in slow-mo for the rest of the game, yes. This is like the opposite of a speed run. It's a slow run. No. Can't we just do it another level and get all the weapons? That's what I want to figure uh, out. Try the Chateau. Maybe it gives you whatever le like whatever weapons are available Specific in that level. Specific level? Yeah, like if you can find it in that specific level, you can get Let's it. Let's find out. I, yeah, do the Chateau, because in the Chateau you get a cool, uh, you get like a... Okay. You get like a crossbow or something. Which level? Oh. That's it. Yeah. There you go. Any of them. Let's find out. Take them all out. Ghost. He's the ghost with the most. Welcome to the doctor's open. Welcome to the doctor's office. Take a little. I gotta go somewhere. Tink. Tink. In, in the uh, tink, first. Tink. Neo, do you Ooh. gotta go tinkle? Tink! Do you hear that background noise? <laughs> tink! 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 What is that? What are you doing? That was in the first Matrix. When Morpheus was getting captured, he goes, Wait, this isn't supposed to happen. And he's like, I have to go get him. I don't know why, I don't know how, but I have to get him. He's like, you're crazy. And then all of a sudden in the background you hear like, Tink! What tink, the hell? I don't, I don't remember that. Oh my god, that's the, like the, the most prominent thing? noise in the whole fucking movie. Like, the movie has like this... Like, I don't remember that. You're supposed to go that way. Sledgehammer. It was facing you in the right direction. It doesn't, I don't care. I, I, I only have one weapon. This is pissing me off. Well, turn around and go down the hall and see what happens. Just play the game. Stop reloading. 
There you go. What the fuck? Um, you just busted something up. That, that wasn't supposed to happen. You're supposed to break that chair and, like, take a, a stake with you, I think. Just keep going and see what happens. I want to see if the game fucks up. Can you kill this guy without the stake? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, we fucked up this game. He doesn't like it very much. And look at my weapons have infinite ammo. I know. Can you fight him? If you punch him, what happens? I don't want to mess this up. This is hilarious. He's like not happy though. He's like, Argh. can we make a remix here? That tickles. <laughs> ooh, ah, ooh, ah. Punch him. Can you actually defeat him though? If you don't, you didn't pick up the stake, and that's what you're supposed to use to kill him. I really fucked this game up, didn't I? Oh, oh you, I you have somehow it. still have I it. I somehow anyway. have it. Ah! Oh, who <laughs> said that? That actually scared me. <laughs> that was like a Kool Aid Man moment. Oh, yeah! <laughs> they don't understand why it's happening to them. I fucked this game up really bad. What happened? You're not supposed to have a pistol in this weapon, or in this level, I think. That's what happened. The pistol, like, they don't understand what the pistol is. <laughs> Make him dance. Do, like, the clob and, like, whip out the clob and shoot him in the legs. I think the head is the only thing that makes him. <laughs> <laughs> How is he not like dead yet? Because he's code Kujo. He's got like a mesh t-shirt, he's dressed like some kind of fetish guy. He looks like Bernardo. <laughs> <laughs> I am Bernardo from an early version of the Matrix. I have a mohawk that's half the size. <laughs> Alright, let's get kill up! Shunk. It's so satisfying chunking them like that. Chunking them? Yeah. Can I play the piano? Maybe. Shoot the piano. With your infinite ammo. This isn't Metal Gear Solid. Feliz. Feliz. I shoot the keys, Feliz. I shoot the keys. They come here, I'll shoot them. That actually scared me when the door burst open. Well, I guess I'll save it here. Corrupt it. Corrupt the virus. Now we are the virus in the West Wing. <laughs> well, oh, I think I'll call it a oh, night at that. Yeah, I think. This is a great night. I really appreciate it. This is a really good run. Actually, this is going to be... I really appreciate the cold. I had the, I had the fun. That, I, I really appreciate the fun we had together. I don't think I'll have to actually edit anything. 